Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching. My name is Paige and we're doing a new like background today. It's just fitting for the video so we're going to try it out. But anyways guys, for today's video we are doing 5 outfits inspired by the one and only Miss Hailey Bieber. Now a couple weeks ago I was scrolling through Pinterest and of course Hailey Bieber came up because I just love her style so much. Something I love about her style is that it's really incorporated by staple pieces. I know she works with a stylist, but both of them do a really great job of putting together outfits and just making it look clean and chic yet laid back but so put together if that makes any sense at all. So I was thinking why not try and recreate them today but also try to recreate them with items already in my own closet. So everything I'm showing you today are things that I already own and have owned in the past. Some are really old items, some are newer items. So I'll try to link everything I can for you guys. But basically that's the challenge today is to try and put these outfits together with staples in my own closet to hopefully inspire you guys to go in your own closet and pick some things out and incorporate them into your everyday outfits. And all of these outfits will also be inspired and put together in order to transition from winter to spring. So these will all be sort of transition outfits that you can actually wear right now. So if you want to see outfits inspired by Miss Hailey Bieber, then just keep on watching. Alrighty, so I'm actually sort of in the first outfit already. We are going to be creating this outfit right here. It's a beautiful, nice, like, chunky beige cardigan with some dark wash jeans, and she has a few accessories in there. So let's recreate. I am wearing this chunky cardigan from H&M. It was super inexpensive. They come in so many different colors, but I just have it in this creamy white color. Perfect for spring. You can wear it as is, or you can open it up. I'm just wearing it buttoned up today. Let's accessorize. I'm also wearing these Levi's wedgie jeans in these darker wash colors. I literally never wear these and I'm kind of falling in love with them again. So great that I'm wearing these today, but both staple pieces. Now to style them up. Haley's wearing like strappy sandals. I don't have much like that, but I do have these beautiful braided heels from Linterval. So I think this will go with the outfit well. She's wearing aviator sunglasses, which the only ones I kind of have are these dupes from Amazon, which I literally wear every single day. So I'm just gonna put these on and feel Haley like And she's wearing a crossbody bag, so I'm just gonna throw on my YSL Kate bag to pull the look together. And this is look number one. Such a staple. I honestly wouldn't think to put this outfit together, but she's really inspiring me with this look, so totally feeling it. Alrighty, look number two is this guy over here. Definitely an outfit that I would wear, especially in spring on a daily basis. It's just so classic and good. So let's walk through the outfit. First off is just a plain white t-shirt. This one is from Zara. Literally any white t-shirt will do. Obviously it does not matter. And I'm just wearing my tried and true Levi's wedgie straight jeans in this light color. I literally wear these jeans in every single video. So sorry about that, but they're honestly such a classic for me. I wear them on a weekly basis. And obviously the star of the show is this robe coat. This is from Zara as well. Just in a lovely beige color. It does have like a tie, but I just tied it to the back because I didn't want it for this look. Classic. And then I'm just wearing sub booties from Aldo. Any booties will do. Mine have a little heel. You can wear flat boots. Doesn't matter. And I believe Haley is wearing a purse as well. So we're just gonna throw on the same black YSL, but honestly you could just wear any black bag, any tote bag. Any bag will really work with this outfit. It's what I love about Hailey Bieber's outfits. You could just accessorize any way you want and it will look just as good. So this is look number two. I love it. Look number three might be my favorite and it's inspired by this picture over here. 
I think I love it because it incorporates a little bit of everything that I love from the pink to the leather. I just love this. So let's get into the details. I'm wearing this wool sweater in this beautiful pink color. It is from H&M. And of course, I had to throw over my tried and true black leather jacket. This one is from Misguided. I believe it's sold out, but I will link a similar one down below. But I feel like a lot of places sell jackets like these. They're still so in and have been for a few years. Jeans are super comfy. They are my jeans from Abercrombie and they have a slit at the ankle here. Another tragic true jean. I wear these on the weekly, just obsessed. And then just the same black booties to pull the whole outfit together with a leather jacket. A vibe. Again, another outfit that I wouldn't think to put together right off the bat, but being inspired by a girl Haley, I'm totally feeling this look and now I want to wear this to like a lunch or something. It's just looking really good. So another look. Guys, before I change, I have to show you the best dupe for Hailey Bieber's sunglasses that she wears all the time. These are from Amazon. Like the classic Hailey Bieber sunglass. So good. I will leave them linked down below. So inexpensive, but like looks amazing. And sorry if you're seeing the ring light and the reflection of the sunglasses. Okay, here is look number four. And here is the picture for reference. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit iffy about this one because it was a little harder to put together. I literally dug to find these pieces in my drawers, but look, we're bringing back things we haven't worn in a long time and that's good for us. I know I have a lot of clothes, so it's really nice to actually use some pieces that I haven't picked up in a while. It's really inspiring me to, you know, use things that I haven't in a while. So here is look number four, pretty basic, but nice. This cardigan is actually older. Um, it's from Nasty Gal. I just picked it up during one of their sales. But it's a cute little like beigey pinky cardigan. It's cropped and like kind of low so I don't wear it all the time. But totally working for this look, not gonna lie. And then I am wearing these Levi's jeans. These are Levi's 501s. These exact ones are old so I know they're gonna be sold out. But I know Aritzia has a lot and obviously the Levi's website has a lot. So I will link some similar styles. But besides the wedgie, Levi's 501s are one of my favorite Levi's fits. So love that for us. I have my Haley inspired jewelry on and the hair and the slick back on this whole video. So it's a vibe. And this is look number four. This last look is probably one of my favorites as well, only because it is so comfy. It's inspired by this photo over here. And I feel like this is a classic spring summer outfit for me when I'm on the go, running errands, walking with friends. You guys know the drill. It's so cute and comfy, so here it is. This just plain tank top is from Zara. It was probably like 10 bucks, just a classic white scoop net tank. These jeans are another one of my favorites. They are the Levi's dad jeans. I will leave them linked down below. They're just so comfy and it's that classic like baggy look that everyone's going for these days. I just have some runners on. These are my Adidas NMDs in white, just a classic to match the top. And of course I couldn't complete the look without my Louis Vuitton multi couche. I had to, I had to pull this out. It just matches it so well. And she's wearing the bag. I mean, she's wearing the pink. I have the green cause pink and a Louis Vuitton ain't really my thing. But you know what? It's the same bag and we're killing it. So this is look number five. This was so much fun. All right guys, I'm gonna wrap up today's videos here in this lovely outfit. I might just wear this for the rest of the day around the house. I hope you guys enjoyed. I've been wanting to make this video for a while now, so I'm so happy I finally got to it because it was so much fun. As always, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up to support my channel, and of course, I'll be back with more videos soon. Love you guys. Bye.